Okay. So, uh, good morning, everyone. It's my great pleasure to welcome you to the uh, third ETH workshop on uh, correctness and reliability. So, Martin Vetchev and I started this workshop two years ago with the goal of educating mostly our own students and exposing them to the latest research in software correctness and reliability. And uh, we are very pleased that uh, over the years, more and more people found this workshop useful. So by now, it's uh, far beyond ETH. So we get, uh, and you look around, people from all of Switzerland, neighboring countries. And uh, this year, we even have a guest from the States. Welcome, David. Um, so uh, I'm very pleased that this uh, seems to be a successful workshop. And of course, that's uh, only due to the quality of the speakers. So we try very hard to get the very best people in the area of correctness and reliability, and uh, it seems we succeed. So thanks so much to all the speakers that came here from all over the world um, to, uh, to give their talks and to explain to us what they're working on. So when you look at the program, you see that we try to uh, uh, give you a rather diverse overview of the, of the field. So of course, there's a lot of static checking here. So program verification, static analysis, model checking, there's dynamic checking, dynamic code analysis, um, testing. There's uh, talks on concurrency. There's uh, talks that are more theoretical, talks that are more applied, talks that are more tool oriented. So we hope you get a good overview of the field um, and the latest research in this area. Um, so the structure is uh, such that today we will have uh, two talks and then a coffee break, followed by another talk and a lunch break. And in the afternoon, we have three, two more talks, a coffee break, and then three talks, so it's a lot of talks today, eight talks, but the last two by Martin and me will be a bit shorter, so I hope it's not going to be overwhelming. And then uh, tomorrow the structure is similar, but it's only six talks, so it's a bit more relaxed. Overall, we believe that the discussions we have here are more important than sticking exactly to the schedule, so we will just, uh, um, in a very non-Swiss way, not entirely stick to the, to the schedule, as you already saw, that we started 10 minutes late, so we take all the freedom here. And so let's have interesting discussions and, and I'm sure we will somehow manage to finish before dinner. Um, one thing that I have to explain, even though I hope it's not going to be needed because we'll all be focused 100% on the talks, is there is wireless here in the room. So the wireless is called uh, public and to log in, the username is WSCR, Workshop Correctness Reliability, and uh, the password is 2015, okay? A few other logistics, um, if there's anything that you need, we have student volunteers in the back. Lukas, Malte, can you raise your hand? So if you need anything, just talk to them and they will be able to help you, or at least they will try very hard. And finally, we will serve a coffee and lunch here in this room, basically at the, the table at the end where the registration was. Um, and of course, you can also go outside here um, and, uh, and use all the space around here. Uh, dinner is not included if you uh, are interested in dinner options. There are a number of restaurants uh, close by within a few minutes walking distance. And if you take a, a written program at the back on the flip side, you will see a list of restaurants. So these are places that we would recommend um, for dinner um, tonight or tomorrow. After the workshop in a couple of weeks, we will publish uh, the talks. Uh, at least those talks where the speakers agreed to be recorded. Uh, so there's a camera in the back, I'm sure you have noticed. So the camera will record the, the talks and the slides, but if you ask questions, of course, they will also be uh, audible um, on, the, on the video. Um, so phrase them politely. <laughs> 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 that was not for you, Patrick, it was just. <laughs> um, No, no, we have a mi this microphone we will carry around for the questions so that the questions can be uh, heard on the video. 